there was a period in time where I was in my closet getting dressed, and I talk about this in the book, where I was at the point for me in my life, I was overweight for my frame, and I was really not happy with my body. One morning I was getting ready and the pants were too tight around my waist. And this is an experience where I was really berating myself. I was cussing at myself. I started to get so angry and I started to cry. And I was mad and I was angry at myself and I was calling myself fat and disgusting and I knew that there was a better way. I knew in that moment that I had to take control and I had to do things differently because I wasn't happy with where I was. And in that moment there was this flash of a downward spiral in my mind and that was the start of a new journey for me. I was going to start working out no matter what I thought my excuses were as a single mother. I didn't care anymore. I was so unhappy with being unhappy that the line was drawn in the sand that I had to make a change. And there was no if, ands, or buts about it. It was going to happen, it was happening now. So I committed to me and I started to change my life. And I started to wake up before my son woke up so that I could get some cardio in. I started going to the gym and I bought a gym membership and I started lifting weights and I poured so much self-love into my body and into my mind that my whole life started to change. And so my book's different because I talk about health, I talk about fitness, I talk about mindset, but I do it in terms of stories, in ways that really are real. And I can tell you all day long to go lift weights, to go do a workout, to go eat the right foods. But if you really don't have an idea about why you're doing the things that you're doing to begin with that are not making you happy, and that has to do with everything from the relationships you're choosing, the people you're hanging around with, the job that you have, because all of that plays into the big picture of who you are. I think the most important part of your happiness is to take your power back and to fully take control of your life. To not allow anyone else to have the reins of your life because it's yours. Because when you support yourself, then you can support everyone around you. And it's so key to work with those people who have been there and who have done it because that is how you are gonna take yourself from here to here in no time at all. And I promise you, when you connect to your tribe and you connect to me or to your coach on this program, your life is going to change and you're gonna love the way that you come out on the other side. I cannot wait to support you on your health journey. Pick up my book, join my program, and let me and my team support you.